Hey, hey guys, how's it going? It's Baggins here, and we're back today with a brand new Realm Royale YouTube video. Now, it has been a while since we last uploaded a video on the Realm, and with good reason, and that there hasn't really been anything new in the Realm for quite some time now. However, that being said, if you do want some daily Realm content, most days on the stream, we are playing Realm Royale. I'll put a link to it in the description down below. Maybe you want to ask some questions about what we're going to talk about in today's YouTube video. Maybe you want to play some video games. Maybe you just want to watch some more Realm. Again, links in the description down below. Come check us out on the stream. It'd be great to see you in there. Now, one of the questions that gets asked in the stream and here in the YouTube comments pretty frequently is Baggins, when is there going to be a new battle pass or when is there going to be a new update? And uh, it's this question that I've kind of been putting off answering on YouTube for a while because I don't really want to create any more negative content. I feel like the world is pretty sucky as it is right now and I just want to keep things positive and keep things uh, fun as much as I can here on the channel. But at the same time, I want to be honest with you guys and I, I want to answer the questions that you guys ask about the realm. So when is there going to be a new battle pass? When is there going to be another update? Currently right now, the answer is kind of never. Hi Res, the guys who make Realm Royale are focusing on another new game coming out called Rogue Company. You may have heard of it. We've made a few videos on the game here on the channel. Again, links to those in the description down below. On top of that, they also have two other existing games, Smite and Paladins. And really, when it comes to attention and priority, Realm Royale is, is getting the least. Uh, they're focusing on, like I say, making the new games and keeping Smite and Paladins afloat. And uh, Realm Royale just unfortunately doesn't have any time or resources allocated to it. Now, there isn't any sort of public post or uh, you know tweet or update where I can show you guys that this is actually the case. You're kind of just going to have to take my word for it. But, you know, the evidence is there on the wall. If we look at even just that Twitter account, the last time they tweeted out was more than a month ago, and it was just for a new skin that's coming into the game. So, unfortunately, right now, Realm Royale doesn't have any future update plans. That being said, to avoid this just being, you know, a completely negative news video, the game is actually doing pretty well for itself. You know, if we look at the positives, uh, there is actually more people playing Realm Royale now than there has been for, like, the past six to eight months. If you look just over on Steam charts for the number of people playing, on PC. Uh, we recently hit a peak number of players that we haven't had in since September of last year. Uh, if we assume the numbers are similar or, or better on PS4, Xbox, Nintendo Switch, you know, we can theorize that there is probably more people playing Realm currently than, as I say, for uh, quite some time. On top of this, we do have limited time game modes to look forward to every Friday. Every Friday, there's going to be a new game mode, some uh, more exciting than others, but uh, just a couple weeks ago, we had a really fun one with the sniper rifle squads with the low cooldown, some of the most fun I've had in Realm in a long time. We have new skins coming out to the shop every few weeks, and in order to get those skins, technically, you don't need to buy them uh, you can just keep logging in on a daily basis completing a quest on a daily basis and that will give you free crowns so you can use those free crowns to get the new skins so there is sort of a reason to continue to play realm week after week however in the long run as uh, more new games come out and as this uh, spooky virus which is probably causing a lot of people to be online right now once that subsides and you know things go back to normal how many people are still going to be left playing realm royale hard to say uh, the game still is fun, but sure enough, over time, uh, the lack of updates probably will hurt the game. A question that you guys ask pretty often is, well, Baggins, why are you still playing? Are you going to make videos on something else if there is no future updates? And the answer is yes. There are, uh, as I mentioned, a bunch of new exciting games coming out over the next few months one of which is Crucible. Now there is very little information out about this game. We know it's being made by Amazon Game Studios along with New World as well, another one I'm excited for. I'll put links to those in the description down below. Obviously we have Hyrule Studios new game as well, Rogue Company. So yeah, uh, look forward to updates on new games there. If there is any change in uh, Realm Royale's development capacity, if you guys have heard any news, uh, if you have anything to point to, you know, to sort of uh, prove me wrong, I would, I would love to see it. Um, but yeah, currently right now, Nothing new happening in Realm, unfortunately, but we're still having some good fun, as today's video will show. So if you like this video, guys, go ahead and click that like button. As always, if you want to continue the discussion, feel free to come in on the stream, I drop a message in chat, say hi, subscribe here on YouTube for more videos, and I'll see you guys all in the next one. Do you have any idea if Hyrus will start working on Realm again? I mean, so it's not impossible, Jake, right? You know, they have the game here, and they've still probably got most of the people that worked on the game are at high-res studios still, just working on different titles. Uh, yeah, it's not impossible, but I, I don't know, man. I think a lot of it comes down to how well the next game does, Rogue Company. It's like, on the one hand, if their new game is a big success, they'll have more money, and then maybe they can invest that money back in on some other game titles. Or, their new game is a big success, 
And they just, you know, focus completely on that. Uh, and they, like, you know, they put all the devs on Rogue Company and Rome Royale gets completely forgotten. Or Rogue Company isn't a success at all. And they lose a lot of money. And then they just need to focus on the things that make them money. Like, Smite and Paladins. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. There's, there's obviously a bunch of different ways it could go. Uh, I can't, I can't predict the future on that one. King Cobra says, Beggins, I have two questions. How are you doing, and what is the new battle pass? There is no battle pass, and I'm doing good, King Cobra. A bit tired, but I'm doing good. Yo, Thor is back in my toilet. Is he doing okay, Prosper? The next game is a copy of Valorant. Yeah. Poor oh, high res. Uh, I think Saw. If you're using the Mage Movement talent, uh, High Flyer, Saw is just like one of the best movement abilities in the game. Nothing allows you to go as far as Saw allows you to go. Baggins, can you tell me how to cancel fortification? Just press the button again that you used to start it. That! My crosshair wasn't even on that guy then. <laughs> I should have missed. Some guy's behind me. So a lot of people around here, huh? Oh, people. No! <laughs> Move last second. Sniper. 10 kills already? Yeah, I don't know though. Most of those were bots. I don't even know if there was a single human there. I find it sad that I think I was good for killing so much, but now I realize they're bots. Well, they might have. Some of them might have been human. The only way to really know is to look at uh, Realm Tracker and look at your recent matches. Just take a look there. But at the end of the day, it's like, you know. Uh, I've said this before. Sometimes I'll fight a new player. It's like, it's obvious it's like one of their first few games playing Realm Royale, and uh, it's actually easier than fighting a bot. Because bots have like auto aim, and you can't sneak up on them. They don't miss shots, really. God, there are a lot of bots though, holy heck. No. Like under aiming. Okay, there's a player. Using an alien rifle. Frost alien rifle.
How do you get that beautiful aim? It doesn't feel very beautiful today. I feel like I'm missing quite uh, a lot of shots. Burst rifle the best hit scan weapon? I would say revolver is the best. Burst rifle's not bad though. It used to be the best. Alright chat, we're getting sweaty. Yeah, so the, the, my understanding, I mean, uh, I get like minimal contact from high res regarding realm. Uh, they haven't said any, like the thing is, why just tell one person? Why not put it on Twitter? Why not like tell the people that you're gonna do a patch for the game? What benefit is it to just tell one person? <laughs> Even if you say like, hey guys, we don't know how long it's gonna be, but there will be another patch for Rum Royale at some point. Uh, we'll give you more news on this when we can. Why not just say that? Does that hurt so much just to put that tweet out? It's like, okay, well, maybe they want to spread the message through their partners. All right, well, why not tell multiple streamers in the Realm Royale sort of area then? Why not convey messages through me and Thor as well? You can put a message out on YouTube. It can hit a lot of people. If only there was a way to know when the next stream starts. Oh, yeah, I can join the Baggins TV Discord. That's true, Drax. Thanks for reminding the people. Did you guys know I have a Discord server? If you guys don't know what Discord is, you need to get on it right now. Type exclamation mark Discord in the chat. It's like Skype, but way better. Or Zoom, but way better. Um, yeah, it's free. And then you can like basically be in chat all the time without even being in the stream. And I also let you guys know when the stream's starting. I let you guys know if we're doing any giveaways, if there's any new YouTube videos up, if we have any announcements. Uh, you know, if we've got any spare poor leg going, exclamation mark Discord in the chat and just click our tap on that link. Jump in on the Baggins TV Discord. You'll never miss a stream unless you don't have Discord open. Can you see each of those faces? You can video call if you want to. You don't have to, but... Come on. Pick me! I think he knows I'm here, right? Could withdraw up to the edge in Enviz and then shoot that way. Yeah. He is in the circle. Three people left, so he's one. Here's another one. Let's move this coffee mug. Yes, Lil Etix. Uh, I've said that about. Uh, Seven or eight times now. Yes. In five hours, a little bit more, five five hours, 20 minutes, we'll do custom games. Yes. Once again, custom games, about five hours, 20 minutes from now. Holy flip, Sanchez. Jeez, dude. <laughs> this is coming out of nowhere. Can we get, a, can we get some big bag and lifts in the chair for Sanchez and the 20 gifted subs? That's a lot of subs. Holy flip, man. How are you doing today, Sanchez? Everything okay, bud? Thanks for supporting us all, all, all the potato streepers in your life. I know you do a lot for uh, some other Good friends of mine as well. Will you play Kranka? I promise we'll do some Kranka at the end of the stream. I'll leave time for at least a couple games of Kranka, okay? Hey, Munchkin dude. We just got home from work. Busy day? 
Have you been like uh pretty affected by the lockdown and stuff or you still get to work as normal? Easy day? Oh well it's, it's always good. This alright. We can, I mean it's 1v1. Um and he has to come down from there, so I can't just wait, but I feel like we should keep like trying to poke him. Come on. Since he has such a high ground advantage and he can fire his longbow faster than I can fire my sniper rifle, the smart thing to do here is literally just to wait like this. You just wait until the circle comes in in 40 seconds. He has to jump off of there. When he lands on the ground, you snipe him and you win. But I'm too dumb, so I'm going to keep trying to snipe him. If he's smart, though, he'll realize that he has to move. Yeah, he's realized. Okay. Dude, I'm such a potato right now. Holy heck. Baggins, please! Why are you so bad? Whew. Man, I made that really difficult for myself. 